Yo, how are you doing guys? Welcome to a new World to Live Online video. This is going to be on all the quests in the beginning area after you first leave the tutorial area. I have just made a video guide on all the classes, like just explaining what they do, what weapons they use and all that good stuff. There'll be a link in the description below if you want to go check that video out. Also, this video is going to be broke down into certain parts. There'll be timestamps in the description below also for, so you can skip to a certain part of the video. So anyway, guys, let's get on with the video. All right, so what I want you to do is press M to open your map and you're going to see these green little icons. I want you to go to all of them and collect every single mission that you can. Just talk to the NPCs apart from the one in the center. As I'm recording this video, there's an event going off, so you might not have that one. So don't worry if you don't. All right, so now you've been and spoke to every single NPC. There should be no more markers on the map at all. We're going to go, you're going to have a weapon now in your inventory. You're going to have a Makrov. We're now going to collect all the items for all the missions at once. All right, so the first item you're going to need is two bottles of vodka. You can buy this from the bartender. You can see the location on the map now. All right, so after you've done that, we're going to be going to the top part of the compound, and this is where we're going to be getting the other four items. There is a fifth item that is part of part two, but you're going to get some now, so I'm going to show them you and advise you to hold on to them. All right, so the items that you're going to be needing, you're going to need 10 sunflowers, 10 milk mushrooms, 10 am aminita, I think it's called. I, can't, I don't know how you pronounce it. Um, 10 rat tails and for part two of this, you know, this whole video, eight rat skins. I found five while collecting these, but you're going to need eight for the next part. So quickly again, 10 milk mushrooms, 10 aminita, or some, <laughs> I don't know how to pronounce it. 10 sunflowers, 10 rat tails and uh, eight rat skins. All right. So when you have collected all them and you've handed all your missions in, congratulations, that is the end of part one to this video. You should be level two after you hand all these in. So let's get on with part two. All right, so first things first, you want, you're gonna wanna buy some ammunition. You can do that by running into this building here and speaking to the merchant that sells weapons, ammo, and all that other good stuff. You do have the macro, but so you're gonna be wanting the nine by 18 ammunition. All right, so now you've collected all the quests again. There should be no marks on the map again. We're going to start off by collecting all the cookery. We need five plates, five forks, five spoons. You can get all them from two specific locations. The first location has two tables. The second location has one table. You want to completely clear these tables. As long as you pick everything up that you can off of all three tables, then you will have all the items that you need. All right, as soon as you have these items, we're gonna run back to the top part of the compound, the north side, as shown on the map again, and we're gonna finish off getting all the rat skins. Remember, you need eight in total. So, like I said, when I was collecting all the first items, I already had five, so I only need to collect another three. Okay, once you've collected your eight rat skins, we're going to be running down to the west side of the compound we're going to be running down to a little water symbol that you can see under the map under c3 and we're going to be collecting five dirty bottles of water and then that'll be it that'll be all the items for this part so just go hang your quests in and that is the end of part two to this video all right part three you should only have one mission and you can see we're going to the north side of the map again you can see on the map the little circle going around as per usual we're going to get all the items from there. This part is super easy, so let's have a run up. All right, so as soon as you get to the building, just run in. You'll see the spanner on the left-hand side on top of the barrel. Then we're going to turn right, lock onto these shelves. Third shelf, screwdriver, look to the right. On top of these power cable generators or whatever, adjustable wrench. That's it. Simple, easy peasy, run back. Hand your quest in. All right, so on to part four. You should have three quests now. One of them... The bartender wants 10 bottles of vodka. The silly thing is, you can just buy 10 bottles of vodka off him and then just give him him straight back and get all your money back. So just go do that and then we'll go do the other two quests. 
All right, so for these other two quests, we're gonna need two items. We're gonna need 10 dog meat and eight dog fur. You can get them from this location that you can see on the map now. Remember, it's gonna be 10 dog meat and eight dog fur. Once you have got these items, this will be the end of part four. So get 10 dog meat, eight dog fur, go hand in the quest, and that's the end of part four. And then we'll be on to the final part of this video. Okay, so now you have your last three quests for part five. Before going anywhere, I highly advise you to go into the bar and buy at least six ciders at the absolute minimum. If you do not know, when you drink a cider, it will replenish all of your stamina. So as soon as your stamina goes into red, as in you are on the last 10%, drink a cider and your stamina will go back to full. All right, so the final three quests of this video we're going to believe it. Uh, we're going to be leaving the compound in the southeast exit because so when you leave the compound, you can now be shot on site by other players. If you're on a standard server, if you're on a PVE server, then you can't. But obviously, I'm assuming you're playing on a proper server. So let's go do the last three missions. Alright, so the last three missions, we're going to be running up to D2 slash 8. This is where we're going to fight, uh, fight the Rat King, and we're going to want his fur. You're not guaranteed to get it first kill. After that, we will be heading to the gas station at B2 slash 2. So first, let's go to the Rat King. Once you have killed the Rat King and obtained your Rat King fur, then we will be heading to the gas station, like I said. So, get your fur, and then let's head up to the gas station. As soon as you get to the gas station, we're just going to run in through the main entrance, turn right to pick up the fire extinguisher, and the anomaly quest will automatically do itself by standing near this anomaly. That is everything done. That is level four. That is part five done. Just go hand in your quests. Congratulations. And yeah, there you go, level four. That's all the starting quests. I hope this video helped. If it did, make sure to subscribe and hit that bell notification. Make sure to give the, give the video a like and all that other good stuff. Look out for the next video guide. That's going to be on, you know, the next set of missions, which is going to be in the MTE oh, location. Yeah. So like I said, I hope you like the video, guys. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace out.